Hi everyone, my name is George. I'm the founder of Xfigura. I wanted to give you guys a glimpse into how to use this tool. So first thing is logging in. You can log in on the top right or right here. It's conceived as a Miro for architects. It merges uh, all of the best AI models all into one place. So imagine right in this central page, you can create a new project. We're gonna call it Demo Live. You can create it and you can click right into it. When you do click right into it, you have, you're gonna have some options right on, this, on the left. You can choose an individual node or you can, you can access the node templates. I'm gonna pull out one of the templates. This is the ideation one. We're gonna build out a lot more of these and you'll be able to share them between uh, colleagues or between each other. So all of these boards are shareable. To share, you can simply click on the share button here, or you can right click on the canvas and say share project. And you can have it as many people as you want all in one space. Uh, if you wanna send feedback, there's, we're gonna build out documentation in the next week, so keep an eye out for that as well. Okay, just to give you a quick rundown of the nodes, you can see each node performs a different task. When you do click into it, you can then pull down and see all of the options within each model. In this case, we're using the Flux Enterprise model and we can generate one image, you can generate multiple images, you can actually then change your model and here you have the full model list, so Gemini, OpenAI and whatnot. So I'll just generate uh, an image, let's see right here. With this prompt, you can generate two, for example, and then I'll just click generate, and this uh, will then load. So one cool thing you can do is pull the node connection right here, and you'll see this pops up all of the options you can get from that node that's loading right there. So you can generate a new image or other things you can do. You can actually upscale that image, you can make a video out of it, a 3D model. You can in-paint a region like you do in Photoshop, like a generative fill. And so let's, I'll put an upscale and image to image as well. Okay, I'll put these, put this right here. And just to give you a glimpse into image to image, also here we have a lot of different models that you can choose from. I'm gonna use the Flux Enterprise one and you can boost the quality to high, for example check your strength and if you want to use a LoRa you can if you want to input a LoRa that you have for in this case a flux dev model or SDXL there's different ones that can take that input you can and so a good thing to do in this case since we have two images is to tell it okay we're going to choose one of these twos it defaults to the first image if you have multiple generations so here Actually, instead of Flux Enterprise, I'm gonna try Gemini. Let's see, Google Gemini, which is more conversational. And so you can say, make this image into an even scene. And you can generate from there. Okay, so now that these images have generated, you can preview them, you can double click. For example, here, you can pan through them and see what type of outputs you got. You can also see all the information for each of the models, and you can download those images as JPEGs or as PDFs. Okay, so here you can see all the parameters, the speed, the prompt, the ratio. Each model has much more, has many different parameters. Okay, so we can connect this guy into image to image, and we can say, okay, we're gonna use Google Gemini, double check that, we can generate from there. You know, this is the connections now live and you can start generating. With that, at the same time, we could also compare and see upscaling. And for that, we have two models, Clarity Upscalers as a credit for one or Magnific. Uh, we also offer that either as a times two or times four and upscaling with all the parameters there. All right, so you can see the image has generated. You can see the before and after, so you can kind of compare the two and get that before and after. Now Gemini prioritizes inference speed, so best the best image to image model you can use at the moment is the Flux Enterprise model. 
Okay, so one thing, the last thing to remember is that you have all of the fun drawing tools on the left. You can upload images, you can sketch, or you can add notes and text and whatnot. Awesome. So hope you enjoy. Um, do share and uh, share your boards. And if you want to see your history, you can go on the history tab and have fun. Thanks, guys. Thank you.